Hola, como estas? We are back with uh, Kentucky Route Zero, and we're doing Un Pueblo de Nada, which is another one of these little interbetween bits. Getting closer and closer to that last act here. I can't believe that, that Conway's just, just gone now. They, they took him. He's gone. He's gone now. I wonder what's going to happen this next act. I wonder where the hell we're actually at. <laughs> After getting up, like, out of that spiral bit. Will we be back in the real world or no? What is all this? I'm not late, am I? Uh... Maybe she's delivering a video? Like your tape was slow mo crew. Tape. Uh, uh, hello, uh, Maya. You. I. Uh, I'm Emily. I work here. Uh, everything. The lunch thing. Just going to work at the station. Hmm. I know some shortcuts. Uh, let's uh, let's just let's let's go, let's go. I don't know what's happening. Are we uh, are we at that TV station? The weird the weird one that occasionally plays strange things in the middle of the night from weird signals. Maybe. Maybe in more than one ways. Uh, okay, I'll just I'll, ha I'll hang out. <laughs> oh. It's like I just made it before the sky broke open. I have a grabby hand. My left boot has a hole, oh no. Ben and Bob. In the woods a week or two ago. Interesting. There's a there there's a there's a window. What is cross eye? Uh Oh yeah, and then we we are here. What all else do we have? James left a patch wired up on the image processor. Slumber crew. Um Do we just do we just have birds working for us? I mean okay. I'm just, just curious. Okay. Let's go back this way. And then, and then, start, start show. It looks like, it, it looks like the hell outside. Oh, well, obviously. If Saturn's in retrograde, you're fucked. What does retrograde even fucking mean? I guess we'll see what Elmo says. Oh. Good day. Yeah. Hmm, or so. A minute. If you met her already, I still want to hang out. I'm sure there's plenty we can talk about. So this is 8192. What is she talking about? Oh, that, that amount of broadcasts? That's a lot of broadcasts. How many is that? 
If you divide that by 365, you would get a number that is something. You would, yeah, let me, let me just do the math in my head real quick. Carry the one, add the two. You would get 22 and, uh, you know, just around 162 over 365. Just something, just somewhere in that range, I think, you know, based on my own mathematical knowledge. So that's, that's quite a number of years. Bird show. It's just the evening broadcast now. <laughs> We're not in decline. Uh, it was the first show not produced by a power company. Sure. Uh, <laughs> those empty humming shots of trees and glowing eyed animals. How weird. The spine of the station, yes. The, s oh, the skin of the station. <laughs> I go back and forth between really liking when it storms and hating it. Uh, I love the sound of storms, but I've also had bad experience with Leaky Roof, and so that's kind of tempered my love of storms. I start getting a little bit of anxiety hearing it. Seen it. You forgot. I wonder if I called that number, what would happen? I wonder if I went back. Or wait, is that the number? I don't. Maybe. Two and six. No, I think it was a different number. But I wonder if I if I went back to that one. Um, the previous inter inter thing. If I put that number in, what would happen? Pueblo de Nada. Uh, a house of nothing? No, no one's home? Something something like that? Oh, let me... Uh, where did I leave this? Did I put it in here? I bet I did. Scans the shelf of videotapes. Oh, what's this? Possible to say. Uh, someone should come here and someone should maybe label these fucking things. At the same time, oh, you people, the lack of organization. Something uh, fell behind the shelf here. Damn you. Damn it. Aunt Connie reframed bare waste studies, death of an airfield, or Pueblo de Nada. What would they all do without me? Uh, is it, do I put it in here? Bird, bird do you put this in? Oh, the bird makes an interesting noise. Thanks, babe. <laughs> We're ready, Rita. <laughs> Fill that air time. Yep, we're ready. Play it. Whatever the fuck it is. I like that my hand kind of moves back and forth. What is this? Uh, I should say something nice. And it's something else. <laughs> uh, she did a lot of research for this day. The people of, uh, the people of nothing. 
guess that guy from the rest of the rest, what did he say he was working on? The Archive of Utopian Thought. Hmm. Well, that seems kind of sad. Is there even a difference? Every once in a while, it dusts off and shuffles around the air with skin like an old dog. Hmm. You know what I mean? It's got some weird shit going on. Who would this be about? Is this like about. Is this like a Native American thing or something? Here's why it's, it's Spanish makes me think of like the Southwest or something. But I don't know. James left a patch. What, what, what is this? What do I do? Do the interview. I'm here in town. You you looking to have fun? Let's get some rest for the long part. Back to the highway, run off of his loft. He said I could sleep in his loft. <laughs> oh, when you say loft, we're not we're not talking like big city loft, we're talking loft loft. <laughs> Ron shrugs. <laughs> but it is haunted. <laughs> uh, oh, Ron. It would be nice to sleep under the stars, but you see, the stars are just... Uh, are, there's a deluge happening. I used to tweet this morning. Kind of chewed up one end. No stars tonight. You didn't invent shit. Chew on some pine needles. Really? Is that a thing people do? I've I've never looked at a pine needle and thought, yeah, I want that in my mouth. Do they know we're rolling? <laughs> what what is next? All queued up, okay. Let's check on the boys. Boys, how you doing? What are you up to? What you, what you looking at? Skins between stations. Because that's where they live, right? The, they live in the static? I don't like the sound of them. I don't like the ghosts in the static. We already went over this. Mashed up, rotted leaves and stuff like compost. Ooh. Ooh, I like that. <laughs> uh, just a normal night. Something for the shut-ins. Holdovers from the company town. <laughs> Oh, this storm is so much. I did hear that. It was absolutely from beyond the grave. Couldn't be from anywhere else. Dogwood? Dogwood? No, it's not frogwood. It's dogwood. 
Uh, it, it must have been dogwood. <laughs> Copy without an original. A mirror reflecting something that isn't in the room. Eerie. Like the mounds. Oh, there's burial mounds here too? That's nice. Of course they're haunted! How could they not be? I just have these lingering echoes without any trace of context. So the ghost speak and we can't hear it, but the tape recorder can. Is that right? I don't know. <laughs> Interesting. Oh. Those are getting kind of full. Somebody should maybe empty those. Not more lakes. Are we gonna, like, die here? Everybody else? Everybody else good? Oh, there's a... It's Ron. Everything on that tape was wild. Everything, Ron. Everything. Even the horses. Mm. Uh. Dust marks and look a bar. Oh, I swear to God, the storm's getting louder. I know it is. <laughs> Sold me the tape. She had the bar sounded artificially. Her bedroom and put Richie's name on it. I don't think there are any wild horses anymore. Surely there's got to be some out there. All of them? Over the years, they've become my favorite Richie recordings. Exactly. But, you can free your pet cat, but I won't turn back into a panther. Shows what you know. Ben was saying... But everything is a ghost around here these days. Hmm... Most of the houses are empty. Community airstrip, then the company town, then WEVP. What about the dogs? Did you know that everything on that tape was wild? So that's a way to take hold. Must be the well. What about the well? Is there an evil well? And now, the weather. The weather is going crazy. More and more. Where, where, where is this ghost? If you want to go down into the rum colony under the earth, in the weird ghost river we have, it's gonna rain! Huh. 
<laughs> it's like, obviously I mean the dyes, dude. Not your weed. Oh, red's coming. It matters. <laughs> Interesting. It is about time. I don't know why, but you know, with Saturn in retrograde, it's it's time, obviously. Interventions. How how does she do it? Oh, even local cable transmissions. How the fuck is she doing that? Five of them as storytelling sessions. I assume if she's doing that, she'd have to be doing it from here. The big blue file cabinet with the daisies. Thanks for the tips, dude. Anytime, dude. So they're trying to find the ghosts in the static. The weather is going crazy. Oh, now there's just a light. The bird is staring into a light. Anyway, what's what's going on over here? Ooh, caves. I've been into caves. Recently, we were just in there. Oh. Uh, okay, get it, get it now. the rack oh. I, I, I think we can wander. Hey, babe. We love you. Did you know Weaver? Was she nice to you? That's good. 
The <laughs> out of town. Ooh, an enigmatic coup. Mm. Oh, the noises this crow makes. Uh, who, who do you think did it? Ah, of course. <laughs> Jeff, are you fuck? Oh, oh, um, this is an issue. I didn't really notice, but there, we're we're in water now. Oh, it's getting kind of weird. Oh, Jeff, shush. Oh, Jeff, shut the fuck up. It could be either. <laughs> he has such a soothing voice. He is so asleep. <laughs> Poor Ron. <laughs> Way to go, Mo. Uh, make small talk. What do you think of the burial mounds? Okay, next that means W E V P T V is haunted. Yeah, I think I think we may be haunted. I'm just I like I'm getting that feeling for some for some weird reason, you know? Should we should we do something about that? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> should we have an exorcism? <laughs> You can't just leave it haunted. <laughs> we don't want to be negligent. Yep. I'd miss her, though. Wouldn't we all? I cannot believe that. Good in the garden and bad in the shower. My rule with spiders is they gotta stay outside of my house. If they ain't paying rent, they can't come in. They can stay out there, that's fine. I'm not gonna, like, go on a spree killing all of them. They're fine out there. But they gotta fucking stay out there. Oh, definitely. Oh. Run, don't go! That was great. Oh. It's it's real dark. And it's real loud. Abandon ship, run. Okay. Are y'all doing good? Are we all... Oh, there's a person out there. Looks like one, at least. Oh. What is that? What's happening? Y'all are being weird. Hmm. 
Don't get closer. Oh. Are you having any trouble? Oh, hello, hello. Don't sneak up on me. He's still carrying a torch for the out of towner. I don't know who that is. What happened with the power? We're gonna be fucking killed. Did you know that Saturn is in retrograde? Is anybody aware of Saturn's retrograde status? Why are we talking about Saturn's retrograde status? There's... There's a lot of water. We cool with that? We, uh... We just gonna be cool with that, I guess? Did you fix it? I just waited and it fixed itself. Spooky. Cool. Oh. If it's flooding that bad, we need to get to high ground if we're not there already. Run. <laughs> Ron knows what he's doing. It's fine. Yeah, a, li a little bit different. Ah. How nice. Start, start reading your poetry. Final bed. It was not men who brought you there to sleep. The men who left you bloody then and flooded had chosen muddy, 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 muddy. Did wild turkeys gobble date and care and whack the moss beneath your eyelids clear? Did cardinals pull the twigs out from your hair and wash your hands and feet and trim your beard? When wood ducks dressed you in your resting gown, and pigeons fashioned chews from leaves and bark, who then sewed flowers into a burial crown, the one who made your headdress was a hawk. I hear that static. I hear it over there. Trying to get my attention. Look at the monitor. No, we're... Oh... She's here. They're here. <laughs> yeah, sorry, Maya. Ghost would be more apt. Watch. We simply watch. Oh. Are we okay? Is, is anybody out there? Oh. Oh, well, now I have to go on. I have to see what happens. Act 5, Scene 1. So stuff's, stuff's, stuff's kind of bad. A town. It is a town. There are people that live there. Oh, it rained a lot last night.
we felt the storm all the way underground. Ron, is that you? Oh. It's us. We made it out. That's everything, right? <laughs> how did how did we fit all this in this truck? <laughs> it's bigger on the inside. I think it rained. It rained a lot, I mean. Uh <laughs> the worms are gonna be out for sure. Have you ever heard a worm sing? What does that mean? Oh, they only sing if they trust you with that reservation, the worms. What do you think they sing about? <laughs> uh, probably just dirt. <laughs> Precisely. <laughs> uh, so where, where's this five dogwood drive? Uh, should we split up? It It is a little bit muddy. Just a little bit. Okay. Oh. Am I a kitty? Do I get to play as a kitty cat? Oh, lovely. Oh my gosh, I'm so fast. Oh, kitty, you're so fast. Oh, oh, there's stuff over here. What are you saying? It has no name on it. All I can read is better days. Better days ahead? Or maybe, uh, dreaming of better days before? I don't, I don't know. Who can say? What's in here? Look at it, kitty. A tree card. Find details into a small wooden pipe. Uh, she loved this spot. The height, the distance. This distance of watching everyone work. Shaping the mounds into the draftsman's supervision. She could see inspecting his plan, the drawing he'd made from her game, the map. Interesting. Oh. Hello. What you doing? I'm a cat. What are you doing? Do you think... <laughs> I, I hope it's rained itself out. Hello. What is this? I don't see any clouds. <gasps> are you another cat? You're a white cat? Do you want to be friends? Do you want to be friends? Oh, yes you do. Oh, we will become one. Oh, it, no, it doesn't want to be friends. I'm sorry. I'm so, I'm so sorry. What is, what is this? Oh, it's me it's meowing. Meow? Meow? Not again tomorrow. That's far too much. Yeah, animals. Animals, no. Who are you? This doesn't seem that bad of a place. It's a nice little town. Hello? <coughs> meow. Me meow? Wanda, meow. Pet me. I'm going this way. I'm looking in these houses now. What are you? Stuff done in the small bag. Uh, or should Alex keep the photo of his father? 
fa father? She dreaded the separation from her son. Alex develop independence and community ethics, but she'd seen the same thing happen to Isabel after criticizing Frazier's new flood control plans. It's obviously a punishment. I wonder, not for the first time, how Frazier had consolidated so much invisible power so quickly. How had he done it? Had he in fact done anything at all to claim this incredible lattice of influence? Or had they simply blindly given it to him? What? <laughs> what? Oh. Who, who? Who the fuck? What do you got over here? Oh, I like being a cat. I like being so fast. I like that I can just go places. I can just be places. I can just go over here. I'm so fast. Oh, he's so happy. He's like bounding. Meow? Meow? Meow. Pay attention to me. There was a kid. I saw the kid. I saw him. I'm gonna go get him. I'm gonna go snatch him. I'm gonna go snatch ya. I'm coming. Well, it's, ooh, they got a whole plane here. That's cool. At first, they only observed the truck from a distance. It was an alien carcass, something that made more sense in death than in life. How many dropped it off in the middle of the day when everything was at planned? They let it sit overnight, alone and strange. Uh, Ron approved. The truck reminded him of New York City, which he'd visited once by bus and which had made a great impression on him, especially the mountains of garbage that dotted the sidewalks. The truck didn't smell yet, but it would. Uh, but it would. A glorious patina built up over decades of progress and labor. Of course, there was nowhere to drive it. Even Ron conceded that. Better spent dressing the town's drainage problems. Yeah, this town seems to have some drainage issues. Condemned messianic ditch. Still, they had a few things to dispose of. Broken flower pots, glass bottles, clothes that didn't fit anymore. They gradually fell into the habit of collecting waste and carrying it to the truck. Once a month, some shadows would come in from the night woods and haul the garbage away on a cart. Oh, interesting. Oh, I, I see them. They're, they're really there. They're super really there. Can you see the shadow men? Or is it just me? What you doing? You doing something with this? Let Ezra fly it. He knows how to fly. Uh, it's good, really good. Mm, girl is operated by pulleys. I mean, 100% mechanical. Wow. Wow. Have you ever flown it? I could do that. Okay. I bet you could. Admire your confidence. Just a little bit, Mel. You can fix that. Eh, shit'll, shit'll buff. Ooh, a matter of hours. Good job. Oh my god, Kitty is so happy. Look at him. Oh, there's more shadow men. Oh no, the station! It's so fucked! Oh my god, you're adorable. Cameras and wiring. She's just been through a certificate program on public broadcasting at the Video Community College. So no surprise there. Nikki showed her the video data bank. James demonstrated the sand and image processor. Tell me more about this. A great collection of videotapes made by local artists, along with a huge library of looked like home movies. There are tapes about local politics, the weather, video dream diaries. Widow's eager to start contributing her own work. Mom's news was clearly bad news. Rita's heart sank a little as they listened. She knew things were unraveling. I knew from experience what that looked like. Wouldn't it be nice to arrive at the beginning of something for once? She listened to her own detail of power company's sudden withdrawal from town affairs. She heard other possibilities. She studied their faces and found concern. Sure, but also something like relief, hope, and awakening of play. Nikki looked like she might have been daydreaming. There are people. These were people, Reed decided. Ready to step out of the company's shadow and build something of their own. Do 
funded by court order. Could that be their anchor? Could it? Oh, you adorable little kitty stretching. Hi, bird. Oh, what is this? The fuck is this? Oh, no, no, no. I saw it come up. I want to meow back at it. Let me, let me meow at it. Meow. 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 <laughs> An agreeable car. Meow. Holy noises. Meow. Meow. Oh, I love the noises they can make. <laughs> Glad we had that conversation. Wait, what what is this thing? I'm not. I'm a brave kitty. I don't give a shit about water. What is this? What is this big thing? I don't want to go out there. Oh, there's more shadow men. What are you doing? What are you doing, weird shadow man? Son of about a dozen yards from the ditch, and he could hear them laughing. He tried not to hear them. Instead, he listened to the shovel munching through the dirt as he shaped the trench. It was wet dirt, mud, really. It made a hungry sound as he shaped the trench walls. Glare from the noon sun made his sinus tingle. The trench was a foot wide now. By the time he was done, he expected it to be about twice that, and run most of the way from the middle of the town over to where it could drain off into the creek. The laughter quieted and the greedy chuckles, and he could feel the men approaching. Who the fuck are you people? Are you are you are you proper ghosts? That only I can see because I be animal. I would assume. There's a rather lot of you, actually. Oh, oh hey, hang on, <gasps> kitty. I'm a kitty. Meow. Meow. <gasps> Something in the bushes stirs. What could it be? Get it. Get it. Get it? Get it? No response. What if I go and get it myself? Anything? No? Okay. Now this is smart of you people. Put your houses on stilts. If you're gonna live in a flood floodplain, at least do that. Ooh, is this like a little church? I want to go in there. Can I go in there? No. No going in. No defeating the Reapers. This is a nice little town. I quite like it. Oh, what do you got going on over here? I won't come over here. I won't look at you. Oh, there's... Oh, what's, what's going on here? Oh, it's Macaws. I was wondering... What shows the book? Uh, it's the results of an experiment called the New Selection. Privately, he called it the Purge. But only privately, in small groups of reliable complainers. The unspoken rules to hold back criticism as long as possible. Experiments, experiments in due time will unfold naturally, without the interference of doubt. George would prefer to complain more freely. Fraser proposed and executed departments just like any other community member, but his experiments had the scorched earth quality. They are all destructive. He moved from one area of community life to the next in search of an excess to cut back. Fraser, you, you fucker. 
Lately, no, not to the library, you scumfuck. Decimating their store of books. Now we're guaranteed something vital. Every time we take a book from the shelves, no more time lost to print a chaff, you bastard. Felt like spit. He felt like spitting. Set off for the woods. Fraser's an asshole, and I don't like him. Can I talk to Lady here? Hi, Lady. Meow? Meow? Hi, Rita. Uh, maybe. Just followed a bird around. No, a, a, a dragonfly, actually. Once we built this thing, they chased birds, too. Oh, did they? Meow. Oh. Really? We followed some migrating birds up here from Central America. Hmm. Somewhere up to Florida. And then here. Is that true? I didn't know that. Skeptical meow. Well, that's what they wrote anyway. Yeah, yeah. Guess it might have been a metaphor. That's nice. <laughs> Ooh, more macaws. There's a bunch of weird birds here. What a strange place. Where the fuck are we? What town is this? Hi, kitty. I'm a very alert. Listen, oh, get that lizard. Get him. Get him. Sketch him. <laughs> get him. Oh, good. He's gone. He's fucked off. He better. I'll get his ass. What are you doing over here? Wow, how'd you get out of there? They must have been pretty nice pigs if they let you ride them like that. <laughs> they were perfect gentlemen. Then what happened? The library of... T I had to cross the desert of broken glass. It was beautiful. The desert was every different color all at once. I was overwhelmed. <laughs> uh, I'll take you there if you want to see it. Maybe on Saturday. Okay. <laughs> Did I tell you I discovered the place where all the garbage goes? Is it in the river? We found that place. You mean the dump? Uh, you're on the right track. Place it with garbage. <laughs> oh, there's a big fire at the center of the earth. It's been burning basically forever. Oh. Someday it will burn out of control and all will be lost. <laughs> the fire is maintained by ancient dinosaurs. They've burned themselves so many times, there's nothing left but oily bones. <laughs> <laughs> I got to ride in a big truck and a tugboat. <laughs> we both had quite an adventure. Uh, maybe I'll, uh, yeah, you know, uh, maybe I'll, maybe I'll see you at the museum sometime. I bet you'll see me sooner than that. We have over here. Oh, it's so wet. Oh, kitty. Don't. Oh, kitty. I don't know if kitty can go out there. That's a bit much for kitty. So, what all do we have here in the middle bit? What do we even. There's this. Oh, there's a place over here again. I didn't go in here. These shadow men are very concerning. I don't like that nobody has acknowledged the shadow men. Nothing? Okay. 
go back here in the middle. Ooh. Hey. Hey, people. I know you. Junebug and Johnny strain to hear the noises coming from the well. It's like two people talking, but not to each other. Maybe they're on the phone? You think the truck's okay down there? Uh, I doubt any thief could get that thing started. Yeah. Oh, what is all of this shit? Oh my, how the f how on earth did we get this? How on earth did we get this up? Oh, my good God. Oh. <laughs> I like the, the kitties making some echoes. <laughs> I like how the uh, symbol in the meowing changes each time to correspond with what the noise I actually make is. It's just funny. Okay. Oh, hey. We'll go here. Alert meow. What is it? Get those mice. Get them. Get them. Get them. Get him. Damn it. Okay. What's all this stuff? Is this more of the same? Looks like it. Ooh. Hello. What you doing? What kind of fish are those? Uh, what, what kind of fish those? Uh, they're goldfish. They eat algae and mosquito eggs. That sounds like a great job. We need more goldfish. Uh, my job today is to write this poem. Who, who is the poem for? It's for the neighbors. Oh, I don't I don't know about the neighbors. That that whole word being capitalized has me concerned. Oh, what you doing? What you doing? What you doing? Oh, yeah, you got to deal with that whole situation. What's this? Oh, it made a noise when I went in here. I don't know if I like noises. Get, get out of there. Mm, what you got going on up here? It's a remembrance. Like a monument. Totally. So they should be represented with dignity and respect, of course. Of course. What else should people say? It makes me feel like they have to be serious when they're standing under it. No, they're just, just planning stuff. <laughs> what else do we have? Uh, oh, ooh, oh, hey, hey. What should people doing? I gotta go pry into their business. What's going on? The mailbox says five dogwood drive. Oh, this like arch thing? Uh is there any mail in there? Uh is there a doormat? Uh I think it's kinda lovely, but I don't know what it is. Uh, is this your place? What? This, uh, this house is new? Oh, it just came in the night. Uh, that's, that's, that's concerning. <laughs> what strange people. 
feels warmer in here. Strangely comfortable. Mm, yeah. If they live here, it's it's real tidy. Nice. I could see myself in a place like this. <laughs> this town needs is a kitchen. We could set up a whole studio. Right at night, we look at this. Oh, a music studio, yeah. And at night, we look at the stars. I could set up a new workshop here. Um, I could fix TVs again. Hmm. You could fit a lot of books in here. On display, like a museum. Hmm. I can get that all cleared out in no time. Feels like it's time to move forward. You think so? I guess we'll be the first. Oh. They saved what we could. I'll, I'll win. I'll fucking win. Don't tempt me. From that to from here to that place of mail. Okay. Wait. What? Where we? Where is that? This is the starting line. Ready? Get set. I don't know where we're going. I don't know where we're going. Go. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. Beat his ass. Beat his ass. Oh, come on, kitty. Come on, kitty. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Fucking just beat the hell out of you. I think? Maybe? <laughs> gotcha. What is happening? How y'all doing? Are you doing? Are you doing good? I saw I saw a kitty. Can I kitty at her? Hello. Aww. Hello. Meow. It is a beautiful day. I guess the weather was pretty bad last night though. Yeah. Yeah. Meow. I am. I'm so chatty. Meow. 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 All right. Well, take it easy. I will. Bye bye. Oh, I see more birds. Can I get up to them? Can I get up in there? Oh, I think I can. Oh, can I bother those birds? Can I meow at them? Oh, I don't think I can. I wanna. I wanna real bad. I wanna bother those birds. How dare they be in my presence as birds? Hey, person. You just uh, laying in the road there? You see those shadow men? Oh, that is a shadow man. Oh, I will sit right in here. This is my tire. One way, hands folded beneath his head, halfway between dreams and the afternoon sun, he entertained the momentary delusion that he'd survived a plane crash. I was vaguely unhappy when that dream faded. 
Slammed into a truck, the driver probably thought the runway was another road. Roads were full of trucks coming and going these days, filling the town with strangers ever since, but he couldn't remember any more of that dream. It was fading quickly and irretrievably in that uniquely frustrating death of past dreams. All the state said they wanted was to knock down some trees, many trees, built a road tying this small town to the larger web of streets and highways that entombed the rest of the country. Ooh. The larger web of streets and highways that entombed the rest of the country. I like that. But Clyde and his inner circle of stunt pilots uh, turned to mail carriers knew that a road would be the end of their secluded paradise. Choppy seas today, Captain. Alright, Captain, let's reinforce the sails. Oh, that's so much water. Oh, there's a sitting man. Can I bother the sitting man? Can I bother him? I want to bother him if I can. What you doing? Uh, no, miss. They don't scare me at all. If you met them, you'd feel the same way, I'm sure. Uh, there's a very old one, and nobody can quite figure her out, but I can't imagine she means any harm. Oh, they like to listen to the static. I do my, uh, I think she listens to the static. They all love the radio. I feel a little bad. I won't be here to care for them anymore. Isn't that something? Let's back to, so you're playing some music. That's a good place for it, I guess. Play music with a small friend in a small bar. We performed together before. You get an art gallery, the idea is to play the theremin for 24 hours uninterrupted. It would be difficult but rewarding, I think. She crazy. Everyone gone, we'll feed these ghosts. Yeah. I don't, I don't know. I don't know who will. No one, I guess. What's going on up here? What you doing? There's really never been a road to this place, why not? <laughs> Gentle cooling. How'd they manage that? <laughs> why? Uh, a detailed series of shitters. Uh, I guess. Yeah, okay. Will you stick around to help? One confident car. <laughs> okay, then. Guess we better get started. What are they planning? He can speak to the birds. He knows their language. Oh, hello, people. Having a little lunch or something? Just in my pocket. My jacket pocket. Is it special? It's got the one we need to play this game, 20 sides. Y'all playing some uh, d and Is that what's happening? More into screens, I guess. That's fair. Someone else's jacket, I'm sure he doesn't need it anymore. I think Conway's dead. I think he's right proper dead. I don't think he's coming back. Now we just need a dark place to play. My friend's uncle said we could use his... Why is that a question? Perfect, I'll hold on to this. Don't lose it. Oh yeah, I forgot I picked up that D20. That was from so long ago. I didn't realize I still had it. Now they're, like, coming upon things that I, I've completely forgotten about and wondering how it came to me. Hello. Meow. 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 Too 
quick to see. Get him. Get him. Get that frog. Goodbye, kitty. Uh, I don't think people are hanging out with these. Oh, no. There's, there's Marianne. How you doing? Doing good? Meow. <laughs> well, hello. <laughs> Wanda, time to wake up. Meow. <laughs> Dead to the world. Nobody's giving me any attention. Meow. <laughs> Ooh, you got it going. Ooh, some music. Nice little side you got. I wish I had a space like this to work on the bike. <laughs> the sloth on wheels. <laughs> uh, uh, not light enough to fly, of course. I guess you don't have much use for a bike in a town with no roads. I don't think Castle has insisted about this place. No roads leading in or out. No one wants to keep their horses safe for now. You can't always lie. A weird little isolated community. Are you gonna pet the kitty? I wanna be pet too. I wanna be pet I wanna be pet too. Oh my god. <laughs> Stick together and still act like you're alone. That's the cat white, huh? Always alone together. Miss Shan's like that, I think. Um, uh, but I don't think she wants to be. She's trying to get out of it. It's a habit. It's like a habit. this meow that's totally broken oh no what was it <coughs> meow waterlogged tapes they might still play who knows oh god can you the horror that they would play but all the VCRs are shot Meow. Don't even know where to put all this. I hate to call it trash. I'd say it's probably trash now if it's waterlogged. I wonder if that garbage truck still works. Maybe. Meow. Hey, look at your stuff. No. Hi, lady. Coming. To find me, you just gave way. But you did good work. It's not your fault. They don't let you finish, that's all. They let you finish, oh, forget about it. This place would be dry as a bone. You always did good work. Meow. <coughs> Meow. It's a memorial. There's a lot of memorials here. What are you people doing? You shadow men. Meow. Uh, she passed in the upper weeds and stuffed them in the bucket. They worked this way for a few hours. 
Dark clouds drifted slowly closer, but wouldn't arrive until evening. Rita and Elmo left to get some tea. The bucket of wheat sat warming in the sun. Dandelions wilted and the clover dried. Some wayward insects continued to eat. When Rita and Elmo returned, they assumed the same roles and continued working. The garden was coming along as well as they could help given months of neglect. With the plant shut down, the company abruptly pulled out of the area and took a large part of the town's population with it. It's clear that the Carver family who tended this garden, the largest and most productive in town for years. Now the garden would be cared for by a new family and feed what was left of the town, whatever it became next. They didn't know much about gardening, but they were prepared to learn on the job. They knew for sure they would plant tomatoes. Those had grown well from this garden in the past. Reed and Elmo worked until it started to rain. The rain washed their sweat into the dirt. Hmm. Interesting. It's so pretty. It's also pretty. This whole town is very pretty. Oh, it's another black hat. Come on. Come on. I'm gonna look at you. Nothing? Okay. What are you doing? Yeah, I'd be worried about that too. Well, it isn't just the rodents. The floors are mostly rotted, I think. Uh, you'd fall right through. I'm surprised they're still standing after last night. Uh, all the building? Oh shit, all of the buildings are getting rotted? Oh, okay, good, good. Most of them have good bones. It's just the ones that the power company built that are rotten. That damn power company! Oh, okay. They ruin everything! The power company moved in here a while back and set it up like their own little town. For the workers. Yeah, it didn't build them too good. It's garbage. They couldn't be bothered. Those bastards! I lived in that one over there, in fact, when I first came here to work at the power plant. Don't you come upon me, ghost. I see you. I see you, ghost. What are you doing? One set foot in there now, though. Oh. I got up. Oh, don't, don't you, don't you do anything to her. You calm down, ghost. Oh, he's walking right around him. Waffles for only weather. I want to go in here. There's no going in. Let's go back here. Oh, what are you? Oh, I will sit here. She watched him. She stood in her own shadow. A few deer hunters and talkers walked past but said nothing to the seer. She didn't even look. She studied the path. This was the path the seer had found in her scrying game. A series of private dice rolls and inscrutable diagrams. At the end of the route, she's in a safe, quiet place. Caverns of leathery blackbirds. A lake of eyeless fish. A towering flame. Now the diver walked the mounds, memorizing the route. He was almost ready. Oh. Okay. There's some mysterious shit. What else we got going on? Can I bother you some more? You're sitting now. Yeah, I they they look they look very heavy, so I'm sure they're even heavier than that. Everyone's heavier after they've passed. It's only natural. It lifts us up a little. Meow. It is me again. I live here, I think. Meow. I, I don't know how much I can do, guy. I'm like, I'm a kitty cat. <laughs> I don't think I can help you, Ron. I'm sorry. Meow. Like, I am a cat. Yes, there's so many sunbeams I have to sleep in. Meow. Goodbye. <laughs> oh, it's getting dark. What you doing? Uh, 
just taking one last look. Uh, just see this ancient earthwork. Why did they build this like spiral? This one definitely isn't, to be honest. I don't know what it was for. Hmm. What does the spiral mean? Oh, what do you got? What do you got going? It doesn't work. I could probably fix it. Could you, though? <laughs> what are they looking at? It's like an old robot toy or something. <laughs> oh, I hear a noise. Where's it coming from? Which way is that? Was it over here? Yes. Ooh. Can I touch it? I want to touch it. I want to touch it. I want to look at it. Ooh, what you doing? Some of these are really old. Maybe we should open them. Go for it. Meow. Oh, no, don't, don't do that. <laughs> you can't open other people's mail. That's a crime. How does that work? If you have, like... Mail and the person is dead. What would the post office do with it? Do they just destroy it? Oh, hey. Meow. Something brown scurries up the side of the tree. Oh, get it. Get it, get it, get it. Meow. A squirrel, get that squirrel. Hey, kitty. Nothing. Oh, I want the cat to like me. You make weird noises happen when I get near you, and I don't like it. Uh, oh, they're up here now. I'm running. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm, I'm a little kitty. I'm full of energy. What is that? It's all you painting those symbols. Would you believe it came to me in a dream? Kind of familiar and anonymous like a bus terminal. Everyone else knows to go, but you're really... Oh, I, I totally get what you're t saying. You're holding some instructions, yes. I'll sometimes get lost in a weird combination of every school I've ever been to. Like, it's both It's both somehow like grade school, high school, and college, like, together. And I have class, and I don't know where it is or where to get to it, and everybody's going to class, and I'm scared, and I'm also somehow in my underwear. Sorry, I don't know why I told you that. Are your day off, or is the burrito closed today? Oh. Mm. <laughs> Nobody at the Bureau expects us to get anything done. <laughs> She's around here somewhere. Had a few too many at the party last night. I mean, you can blame her. Those tiki drinks go down smooth. Mm. 
If it were up to me, I would leave this place alone. Let it grow back on its own. You never know what'll grow back after a place has been knocked down. Yeah. 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 It's so pretty and idyllic. Okay, I've got that going. Your bow. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Hey, hey. You reading in? How about Greg Rabbit? Does a Greg, is there a Greg Rabbit? Greg the Rabbit? Does the rabbit get mail? I don't know. He, he just has the last name Rabbit. Not anymore. Maybe he died. Great. <gasps> You're opening it up. It is our pri priv. It is our privilege to something. It is our privilege to inform you that your app applic application application. <laughs> It's been accepted. Your studies can begin as soon as you arrive. Oh, Greg, you got accepted to college. Good job. Yeah, good job, Greg. Good for him. Oh, I saw that. I saw it. I saw it. I saw that shadow pass over me. Architecture. Ooh, he's going to school for architecture. That's nice. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Is there anything else over in this bit? I went in here the once. There's weird noises that happen with all the birds. Can go down in there? No, I want you to go over here. Why is there so many birds? That's an odd place. Oh, can I ring that bell? Can I do that? I want to ring it. Kitty, can you get up there and ring that, please? No? Okay. You still open? Oh, there's horse. They're horsies. That's nice. Oh, the weird spiral. Uh, where is everybody? Oh, there you are. It's like people start disappearing on me. Don't you people disappear? Don't make this become a whole ghost town. Look at this place. The library. What a mess. Basically like this building's only next of kin. I don't think anybody else, nobody living, has spent as much time exploring it. I'm the designated rememberer. I remember quite a moment. I close my eyes and picture this building. The floor, the ceiling, the arc of the hallways. I like that kind of history. The lived in details. That's how you know people have always been people. Always made choices and nothing was inevitable. Yeah, this is a special place. I feel a little guilty. But it's time to move on. You know, for me anyway. Maybe some community will grow up out of the rubble. It's happened before. Hey, aren't you? Yes, I am. Uh, <laughs> just yet, yes, I am. Uh, we were talking about everything. Is this your family? Uh. <laughs> Johnny, 
Johnny. Um, <laughs> Ezra looks at Johnny. Sure we are, right, ma'am? Whatever you say, Cricket. <laughs> Ron dug a grave. Oh, oh, he started glowing. Are you glowing? Oh, well, never since then I've just been treating it like a little cafe for the town. Uh, everybody pitches in. Yeah, it's a community thing, but I make the waffles. <laughs> oh, a, a, a waffle recipe. Why so secretive? Mystery adds to the flavor. I just can't bear the thought of my son of a bitch from that power company. <laughs> Mystery adds. We'll just say the mystery adds to the flavor. Mm, place. Uh, just. Hey, people gotta eat right. Well, you know, some people. <laughs> y'all, y'all kind of robots. I think it's it's not, uh, unclear. They make robot noises. What is it? I'll get it. Get it. 3A, lay paper flat, 3B, bring bottom left corner up to right corner, crease for firm, steady pressure. You can apply the only gentle pressure. Looser flowers felt more alive. She rolled her wrists. It was the sixth hour of her assigned company store shift. She made dozens of flowers. Okay. Okay, interrupt the filaments from step nine. She put Ron's bouquet down in the sales ledger as a romantic bouquet, but she really she was just buying in bulk at a small discount. Since the company started allowing resident uh, workers to donate power, uh, paper flowers to Aunt Connie, in more six days they become kind of a shadow currency for local trade. Men yelling, blows landing. Hmm. You started glowing. Can I look at it? I want to see it. The City of Ladies. Interesting. Meow. Meow. No, I've never read it either. Meow. Let's take a look. I'm glad that everybody can just understand me. Here we go. Minerva, Circe, Sappho. And some ladies from the Bible. I know what they be doing. Uh. Meow. I think they all get together. Oh, I, I think I know what happens in that city. I guess a bus ticket, eh? Meow. Meow. Meow, meow, meow. So that makes you kind of wish it never stopped raining. Oh, that's, that's a lot of feet. Six feet's the wolf for a person. Let's say the average person is five foot nine. <laughs> the neighbors were about 15 hands, so that's pretty close. Do you measure from the front legs or the back? Well, at least I'm putting the math in. If this were still company proper, they'd be off to a landfill. Cold sons of bitches. It's been four hours driving them out of the water. I got the measurements done now. Carved into my muscles permanent. God, that's not how I want to remember them. Got so deep so fast. It wouldn't have been that deep there. I know who to blame, I'll tell you what. Just that range did just like they were supposed to. They ought to be here still, cleaning it up. Guess they left a vacuum, the power company. Hell, not that I miss them. Sorry, Ron. 
that's going to take him a while. Oh, what's going on? <laughs> In the bushes. No. Probably. Oh, don't get, don't get thorny. Raccoon. <laughs> Tell you what, if that raccoon comes back into town, we'll leave some food out for him. Yes, ma'am. Oh, I get strangely dark up here. Oh, it's fine running in the graveyard. They're dead, they don't care. It's, people are trying to rest. Oh, they're fine. Meow. I agreed. I will run. I don't give no shits. What are they gonna do? Get at me? They're dead. I will run all around. Oh, you finished your little thing here. Or you're about finished. Looks good. I like the horsies. Very cute. Oh, we got here. Are you gonna go for a ride? Can I come? Oh, oh, he going? Oh no, he he ain't going. He ain't going nowhere. Oh, maybe, maybe. No. Go, go, go. You got it. You got it. Is he going? Is he going? Fly. Oh, it, it fucked. It has an aura. Know what I mean? An aura. Wasn't exactly used to cut apples. What does that mean? It's meant for greater things. What does that mean? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Okay. Where are you flying to? Flying? Ha! Just check and see if everything's working okay. Okay. Is it? Is it working okay? That looks like it would be so much fun to fly. Just like a little thing around you. There's like a seat, some bars, and then wings, and an engine. I'd do it. Here we go. Keep your distance now. Go, go, go! Oh, he going. He going. Go. 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 You can do it. You can do it. He's real, he's real slow. You gotta, you gotta get up going a lot faster than that, guy. You gotta go. Oh, he ain't going nowhere. Oh, what are you doing? Uh... 
notes on inhabitants. Small group, mixed duration of residents. It's much easy now. Haha. <laughs> Prepare our eyes for potential reclamation. Mm. Alright, well. Is that so? Maybe more people will come here. They seem to be okay, people, the Bureau. They don't seem like they're bad or anything. A little weird, but you know, it's fine. Miss them for sure. I'm so thoughtful. Uh, bet. Where do you think you'll go? Just poking around the rubble. Pulls a videotape out of the rubble. What one is it? Home movies? <laughs> Probably some weird art video, statistically speaking. Uh, pulls a piece of slate adorned with partial circuit diagram rubble. It's, um. It's, it's some kind of image filter. You know, it's kind of a package deal. I think the ceremony is a what a ceremony. The neighbors. Well, what time is it then? Seems like it's at least past noon now. I don't think all their stuff in here. In this strange arch house. That I, I, it seems very odd, but you know, it's it's a place to live. I really like these shadow people. I think they're very cool. Oh, I will get right in this box. I think casts it cross legged in the shade of a light aircraft. Showing cards. Demand for aerial stunts have faded almost completely, and many of their company have died or aged out of the profession. Clyde and Cass found in the remaining pots a steady flow of contract with delving mail to remote rural areas. But this place was abandoned. Cass's cars predicted they'd be here for quite a while. Oh, I hear some movement. You can track them down anywhere. Can I get in? Let's see what you've got. It looks like it might still play. Oh, Bill Monroe. Great. I don't know who that is. Yeah, we've had a few of his. This is a barnstormer. Popular. A barnstormer. What's a barnstormer? The jukebox started to wear down. The longer it would run, the slower it would play. And these weird echoes would start to come in. Yeah, I've heard that a lot recently. Like the music was leaking and just pulling up in the bottom somewhere until everything was drowning. few hours, no matter what you put in that jukebox, it'd come out strange wrong. I don't know, that sounds pretty cool to me, man. Okay. What you doing? Oh, oh, can I hit it? Can I hit it? I want to hit it bad. Yes! Is everyone being gathered? Hello? What you doing? Oh, you walked right over me. 
He's a man with a plan. I'm gonna follow him. Oh, it is getting dark. Oh, are we all coming together? Looks like it. Hey y'all, thanks for sticking around for this. I know we've all got places to... Well, if anybody still needs somewhere to go, be sure and speak up, okay? I think Ron's heading through the woods tonight. Back to the road if you want a caravan. You staying, Em? Uh... Yeah, sure, I'll stay. Uh... This place has good bones. Got some friends to bury. The neighbors. Nikki has a poem and I have a song. If anyone wants to say anything, though, I'll go first. The neighbors were kind, gentle, beautiful horses. I used to go on walks with the silver one out in the woods by. Why didn't anybody ever give them names? The silver one. Well, I guess he was gray, but his coat looks silver in the light. So I always called him that in my head, and the other one is the other one. <laughs> I love these horses, but you never know it if you heard me talk about them like that. So I'm sorry, silver one, another one. <laughs> Sorry I don't have better names for you. You deserve better names. Also, sorry I'm so bad at this. Anybody else have anything to say? Uh, we can give them news because their names weren't ours to give. They were here before us, you know. They came with the people from Central America, you know. The Utopians, the people of nothing. People of nothing arrived by horseback in October, and their first experiment was to free the horses. Generations ago, of people and horses. I don't know when we started calling them the neighbors, but we should have called them the people, I think. They were the only consistent residents of this place for over a hundred years. Now they're all gone. Who are the people now? I've got something to say. I just want to say these horses used to crap on my floors, but it never bothered me too much. Never mentioned to anyone. I don't want to make a thing out of it, but if we're clear in the air, well, that happened and it's okay. I mean, recently, too. I was cleaning up horse crap just a couple days ago, and I'm saying it was okay. Would have been okay if any of you wanted to crap on my floors. I just want to say that. I would have cleaned up after any of you if you crapped on my floor. Thanks, Ron. <laughs> okay, I guess we better move on. Nikki, you ready? Thanks for sticking around, like Emily said. It's so good to have you all here for this. I know some people had to leave already. I don't judge anyone for that. They like to be around people. My, you and our other brothers might not know about the out-of-towner. He came here to work for the company to dig a ditch. The company worked him good and hard and for less than he was worth, but it wasn't enough. They had to use him up completely. After that, we became ungovernable. First out of shame, then grief, then anger. This is a poem for the neighbors, but it's also for this town. Yeah, we're gonna bury this town today when we bury these horses. It's the same thing. What do you think will happen next? We'll all walk out into the woods and leave this place empty. No, I guess some of us might stay and build again. That's alright. Couldn't be me, but to try is your birthright. If you stay, you'll be building on top of a grave, but that's true anywhere. The whole world is built on top of graves. Look for me under your boot soles, as the fella says. Nikki clears her throat and begins reading from the paper she's holding. Uh, I think the grass will never grow again. Here where it grew so sweet, now only clay will rise to meet the morning air. Who would eat grass now when our neighbors sleeping lay? her attention to Shannon. Our neighbors were the best of us, of course. It's always so. Our better selves, clear of ourselves, where we can see their glory glow. They glow now underground, our friends with love. <laughs> to greener pastures, we might say, but lie. Where friends have gone, we hope one day to go. T -t -t -t. 
To distant valleys, hope to better friends. Home to better friends. Uh, return their souls in peace and gently roam. Then we buried the horses. I've heard of a land of joy and peace and wonderful light. A beautiful place of mansions fair and skies so bright. Where all who believe the Savior dear forever shall stay. And having been saved by grace divine, I'm going that way. I'm going that way. I'm going that way. Yes, dear, the Savior I adore is with me each day. I'm clinging to him. And never to stray Just sing and praises all day long I'm going that way Well, glorious news I tell and sing As onward I go For those who are still astray in sin My Savior may know I want them to sing that praise above some beautiful day. For glory to him who died for me, I'm going that way. I know I shall meet him at the gate when trials are past. I know I shall meet him face to face in glory at last. Oh, I believe that when we meet, well done, he'll say. While trusting the soaring demon love, I'm going that way. I'm going that way. I'm going that way Yes, dear, the Savior I adore Is with me each day I'm clinging to Him And never to stray To sing praises all day long I'm going that way That was really nice.
the end. That was a fun one. I quite liked that. I like these shorter, sort of art, artsy games. I think they're real fun to play something a little bit different. A little less, less typical of games, but that, that was really nice. I liked that. I've been wanting to play that one for a while. So uh, I, ho I hope you enjoyed. Um, I think I, I may do something more like that in the future, I think. There's a couple of other similar, like, kind of artsy, more indie games that I've had on my mind. I'll have to, I'll have to see. See if there's any good ones that I've been wanting to play. I think um, one that comes to mind is like To the Moon. Like there's a series they have, if you've heard of that one, that I quite find very interesting, at least going off of the descriptions. I may play that one in the future. Hmm. We'll see. But anyway, I certainly hope you've enjoyed. I did enjoy my time. I'll see you next time. Goodbye!